by going in here. <laughs> it's like a little petrol garage shop. Um, we're going to pick up a few yeah, new things. Uh, this time I'm going to buy uh, some stuff for the car. Nice. Oh, you've got a sticker for it this time. Yeah, we're going to do some more customization. Um, this is spare spark plug. This is for a side quest we're going to do in this build, so um, gonna I'm going to buy it now. Because we don't have time to come back. Please come again. Well, you're all in here now, aren't you? Come on, get out of the way. Get out of the way, Gladio. Come on, Gladio. Yeah. Okay. And then we're going to go into a diner quickly. Um, going to have a quick chat to someone in here. Gladio is very excited that we're going in the diner. Uh, so what we're going to do here is just to show you how you can unlock things on the map. So when you come to diners, if you hit talk, uh, this guy will actually bring up the map and then start uh, pointing out things of interest. So here we've got New Havens, that's where you can camp. Uh, he'll also put up parking spots. So these are like little places you can properly leave the regalia. Just like real chefs outposts. in diners would do just for Just like you. real chefs in yeah. diners. And procurement points, so where I can draw. <laughs> What can I do you for? Oh, well, that um, helps you with the magic, doesn't it? The exactly. drawing. Exactly. Uh, you can pick up hunts here as well. Now, I talked about these briefly yesterday. Career. I already have the Howling Winds hunt. I'm not going to take another. I'm just going to leave. This is the one we're going to do. But you can see they're rated. It can tell you when you can two find the down animals. Down the bottom look like hardcore hunts. Yeah, level I'm, 22, level 28. Nowhere near that level. Tells you what bounties you can get from them as well. Uh, but we're done here. That's Stay all over. I needed from him was just to show you guys uh, those few bits. Off we go then on our adventure. So before we do that, we're not going to camp uh, like we did last time in that same place because we've done the race with Gladio and I don't want to almost lose that again. So we are just going to stay in this caravan. So you, you can camp, you can stay in caravans and cut is, you can stay in luxury hotels as well, is that right? Yes, so depending on the type of accommodation you're staying in, sort of depends really what it does. It's cool. So you get better bonuses if you stay in yeah. nicer accommodation, but you can only cook food if you camp. Yes, and either way, here we are, you can still, you still sort of do your levelling up and you can still look at your photos from Prompto, plus the cutscene for this one's really cute, so I just thought I'd leave it. Adorable. Reminds me of camping holidays. That's Man. a bit of a sad, sad camping holiday. Sad camping holidays in a tiny caravan. They look too well dressed, don't they, to be, to um, be staying in this caravan? I mean, I think they're doing all right for themselves. It's just a little bit adorable. So I thought we'd just camp here. Also because I just want to put the time of day back to being an AM because I've set this quite late and I'll I'll hit night time if I continue this demo and I don't want to do that, not while I'm playing today. Night time's dangerous. Night time is dangerous. 15, isn't it? So Prompto's gonna level up. And we can look at some of the pictures he did. Save the ones we like. Discard the ones we don't. Damn, He's still learning. <laughs> look at Umbra, sure how adorable. Good side. Um, but that's it, that's all we're gonna keep for now. You can then go into the menu and look at those at any time. You can save up to 100. Uh, what we'll do now is people yesterday got to customize the regalia. We'll do that again so that we have something fun to drive around in. Make it look good, guys. Uh, one of the decals I bought is... Oh, have you got... Okay. Yeah, yeah, that the decal one. On. Yeah. Is that the one I saw earlier? Yeah. Oh, you're going to love this. Uh, um, yeah, it's something. Um, you could buy quite a lot of them. Let's chat to oh, Sydney. Well, I gotcha. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, we didn't see decals yesterday. I hadn't bought any, so I thought I'd buy them before the save today. Be? Okay, here we go. Well, right, so fancy. it's deep sea blue or ivory. Deep sea blue today. Anything the interior. The interior. It's lots of colours. Shout when you see the one you like. You can't have gilded lilac again. Mustard, I heard. The mustard. mustard is just the back bit, yeah? Right, oh, wheels. wheels. We had gold yesterday, so we can't have gold again. Amethyst, right, okay. Now, here's how decals work. So if it's a full body well, decal, what I can do about the decal, it looks oh. like that. Oh, oh, 
It's it's a something. <laughs> if we take Anything it off like? and go out, we can the then details? look at the other ones. I bought one of the hammerhead stickers, so you can shrink it. Oh, you can change the size as well. That's cool. With the right analog, move it with the left. But you can't have both because you're having a full body paint or you're having hammerhead. So we'll do the hammerhead ones. Uh, we can put it on both sides if we want to. Probably haven't got them the right size. That'll really annoy me when we're driving. <laughs> uh, now, if anyone saw my interview with Tabata Sam from Gamescom, uh, he spoke about the when you're in the world, you can find car parts. Bring them to Cindy, and you can install these components on the regalia, and it says, install new parts to improve the regalia's performance. We don't have any of those. <laughs> Are we not going to put the, the lurid no, no. decal on? No, we're not. No, we're not. Okay. Ha, ha, ha. I'm still in charge. There she well, is. Here she is, just like you ordered. It's a cool thing that no one player is going to have the same regalia, pretty much. I like that. Yeah. Right, we're going to make the same drive down to the beach, but we're going to stop halfway this time to complete the hunt, so I'm going to show off the battles a little bit more than I did yesterday. Let's go. Uh, Ignis is still going to drive for me because it's just easier. We're going to continue the quest and we'll stop halfway. Everything in order? Yep. Right, now I had Balam Carden playing yesterday. You're going to put some tunes on, Holly. I am. Look, he's stopped because to let a car out. Oh. Considerate driving. Well done, Iggy. I'll get out oh, of the way, honestly. Oh, I'm literally parked in the road, Ignis. That's awful. Right, now they're gone, you can carry on. Thank you. Isn't he good? Um, I'm going to put on, I think... He shouldn't have pulled out in the first place. It's a minor. Uh, I'm going to put on one of my favourites uh, from 10. Spirit Unplugged. Right. I think it's the perfect driving song as well. Uh, so it's currently morning here. The skies are blue, the sun is out, and it's just looks... Oh, look at that. I can't wait till I can play this and I can I can control what's on the radio. <laughs> Final Fantasy 9. Remember, the driver Final gets Final Fantasy to 9 pick. tunes will be going on in my regalia. We've had quite a few, so when I've been practicing this today, uh, we've had quite a, a few on nice a moments. I remember reading about this place on that wanted poster. So we're going to stop here, you are we, this time? Yes. For a little bounty hunting? So because we happen to be driving past the area where the bounty oh, yeah. is, they've actually Bring given me a prompt and said, you can go oh, and do oh, this bounty now. It has already been brought The hell's got into you two? If you just click OK, you don't get that little bit where prompt gets really excited. OK, now before we do that, uh, let's get a few other things sorted. So let's open up the menu. So first of all, I'm going to change the quest to the Howling Wind of Hunger, so it'll appear on my mini-map. Um, what shall I do next? Let's go through the Ascension uh, the ascension grid slightly. So this is where you do leveling up. Any of you play Final Fantasy X? Yeah, it's a, it's a bit like the Sphere grid, or that's how I see it anyway. Somebody left a comment yesterday on the YouTube uh, channel when this was uploaded and said, oh, you know, if the game is, you know, X number of hundreds of hours big, that's, that Ascension grid's not very big. Okay, this is not the full and final game. We're playing a, a, a section of the game that is purposely built for showing at events, okay? So this is not necessarily how it's going to be, but they have to make it so that when you play it, you can have these fun things. Um, so we've got this one. We want to do the polearm link and... So these could be abilities that you may not unlock till a lot further in the game. Yeah, But we're, we're just being able to showcase them here. And then obviously, here are the other ascension grids for who you're with. So if we look uh, if we look at Ignis, we've got Mark, Analyze, Regenerate, First Aid, Save as Fortitude, and obviously as we come down, First Aid Expert, Overwhelm. Overwhelm, I like the sound of that. And we can come up here. What was that? I saw Royal Guard, I want to look at that one. Move quickly to Nox with a shield, enables breakout attack from cover. So these, you know, you can then customize how the guys are going to be in battle. So for example, if you, you know, you want a healer, maybe you could look at using some of the first aid ascension grid with Ignis. Not going to do that. I just want to unlink these pole arms. 
when I was practicing this, I did an epic link strike where P Prompto literally threw his gun at Noctis. He grabbed it, like Noctis used it through back at Prompto, and it looked so cool. And I will never be able to repeat that on live stream. Oh, Holly. <laughs> but I'm gonna try. Maybe something else amazing will happen. Uh, maybe. Now let's look at magic. Um, so this is how you get magic in the game. You absorb it from the world, from rocks, which I'll do a bit of later on. Did it on the last stream. You then add a certain amount to a vial, and then you then create it to throw it. Think Riku's final uh, mix, mix, a mix in overdrive. Final Fantasy yeah, yeah. Uh, It's a bit like that. So we'll do lightning, because I think it's really cool. The more you add, the stronger it becomes. I'm not going to add it all, because that's greedy. Uh, let's just do, we'll do 30. Uh, there we go. Power 30. Now, on nice. this one, we can add other components to give it like extra things. So for example, if I add the scorpion barb, it also casts poison. So it's a poisonous lightning spell. It's a poisonous lightning spell. That's cool. Craft it. Venom cast. Equip it. So this is the equipment menu. May as well show it now, it just makes the most sense. So you have the three weapons that you can switch between in battle using the D-pad at any time to create your combos. You can add magic here or another weapon. So Noctis can use swords, great swords, pole arms, daggers, firearms, shields, machinery, royal arms. Someone asked me to show them. I don't have any to show. Fire, ice, lightning, and wild. Now I was messing around this earlier on and I added 10 ice, 10 lightning, and 10 fire, and it created a wild spell. And what's wild? It does all three. Nice. So you take it and you equip it and that's how you use it. For example, with the guys, they can't. He can only use great swords, that's Gladio. Same for Prompto, firearms, and the same for Ignis. He can only use his. But you can still give them magic. So I'm going to give some fire spells to Gladio and he should hopefully use them in battle. Uh, while we're here, uh, we'll change what they're wearing as well. Because we didn't wear... <laughs> oh, wow. Let's get them in their jeans, yeah. Uh, and he's going to wear these today because he didn't last time. He actually puts a top on if you take his jacket off, which is amazing. Casual looks really cool. Casual, no jacket. But we're going to do that one today. Don't put him in his pinstripe suit again, please, I like the Holly. pinstripe oh. suit. Is he cool without his jacket on? And then we have casual no jacket. Can I do that one? Thank you, Rob. OK. Uh, and then Prompto. We're going to take the jacket off, I think, for Prompto. He's looking very casual. <laughs> Look at them now. now. They just what a ragtag bunch of men out for the day. You can also have a look at the photos uh, you've saved as well. These are just the ones I've saved so far. Out of interest, when you're in here, you can look at skills. Noctis, Gladio, Ignis, and Prompto. And that's how they level up. So I'm level two with uh, Ignis, uh, with Prompto. Fishing. Level one of fishing. Fishing. <laughs> anyway, let's get going. Still don't like, no Still don't like fishing. No. I'm having <laughs> sushi for dinner. Okay, so now on my mini map, you can see that we're heading towards um, where this hunt is. And we've got the icons appeared. So you can see them over in the distance. That is actually the group that we're going for. Oh, uh, I didn't get it. Saber tusks. So you can now see on the mini-map, it's gone yellow. That means I'm in the zone where that hunt is taking place. I actually just have to find them. These ones are not too hard to find. There they are. And as you can see, because we're in the area, the guys start to crouch as they run. So they can't be seen. Yeah. Now, in theory, Gladio hey, should... Got a little problem over here. Cool. He's behaving we'll today. No, he's Whoa, not. That wasn't part of the deal. I am not into wildlife. More of a pet guy. Oh, I love the gene strike. Killing. Nice block, Holly. Get in there. Yeah, come on. I'm doing better than yesterday already. No, I'm not. Nice. 
I'm in stasis. I've used warp strike too much. I also don't really care. I love warp strike. <laughs> Just get that MP back by smacking him. Oh, there we go. There's, and there's, there's Venom the Cast Thunder. Parry. Nice parry. Get in there. Finish it off. One more. You can see the lightning remains on the floor. It's so cool. I do love the environmental effects of the uh, the lightning. Done. Now, look at Noctis. I rolled through the um, lightning a little bit too much. And We're a bit char grilled. Uh, you'll need to rest for Noctis to take a bath. Um, I think, well, these guys, man, no, it, Gladio is, um, wow. char-grilled. I think Noctis' jeans are officially worn now, aren't they? Yeah. Look how nice. clean these two are as well. Anyway. It's like a cartoon, isn't it? When an explosion goes off in a cartoon. Yeah. <laughs> right. So that was, uh, that was some magic in use. Uh, there's a couple more monsters roaming around over here. We'll do a few more battles, uh, and then we'll head sort of down to the coast ever so slightly. I am absolutely lost for time. Can you ask the man in your ear to tell me how much time we have? We can see it there. Is that We've right? Got seven minutes. Seven minutes? Yeah. All right, we won't do one more battle. We'll go to the beach. Curious as I am to see, my priority is keeping his highness safe. Back to the regalia. Oh, they closed the oh, bear now. Oh, they have actually cleaned themselves. Last time I had to go to a hotel and change them. Maybe it's because I went there so quickly afterwards. Like, you're filthy. All right. Back in the regalia, you lot. I'm going to have a victory sip from my mug. <laughs> Auto drive. Yeah. What should we listen to next? Something from not Final Fantasy VIII or ten. Yep. All right. Or 14? Or 14. Not 13, no. Yes, oh my god, blinded by the light. Nine, go back, Thank put you. a nine one on. One nine. Yeah, you just went past them. Okay, which yes. one do you want? Uh, no, we've gone no, back. That's 10. Set. Let me go back. There you go, original soundtrack, a place to call home, Final Fantasy IX. Roses of Roses May, of Roses of May, May. Yes. okay, Roses of May. Brilliant song. Uh, let's have a little look. Last time we did this, uh, Gladio fell asleep, um, and then he woke up, and then he had to pass Ignis a coffee. And Ignis is drinking and driving, which is really, really bad. Come on, we'll zoom out a bit now. Come on in. For our next story, Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Well, so there's a story coming through on the radio. A little bit. So this happened yesterday as well, so it's like a, a, a moment, because this is a quest for the actual story that we're on. Playing a part in this historic moment. You've even got a fuel gauge down there. I never noticed that before. Yes, you do have to refuel, which when we park up, I'll show you Noctis for fueling as well. He can do some work. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages. I just can't get over how big this world is. I'm going to try. If we have enough time, I'm going to stop and do a bit of camping. So like, do you want to do another camp or should we just go down to the coast? Go to the coast, okay. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbols of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of I love the beats. different viewpoints you can a choose. Seems, nevertheless, amenable to the prospect. And not to your legs. You can turn a lot of the HUD off. So this bit in the left, What's that? Uh, where it's got the driving menu, What's if you off? want that off, you can turn that off. Uh, I was going to stop a little bit further back. There is like a broken down car. It's a side quest. You have to hand in that spark plug that we bought earlier on. Uh, sadly, we are a bit pushed for time, but you literally do stop. It's the quest. You can hand it over. You get some AP. Uh, it's just to show you something a bit different. But I sadly, you can stop time. whenever you want anyway and just hop out and wander around if you like. The Gladio just put his book away. I want to go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Nobody goes to Golden for an island though. They go to kick back and get massages. Nearly Not there. The seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. I have time for one more battle on the beach. We'll do that, and then uh, I will sort of head to take us in slightly to where the cutscene is. Are we going to see Ignis's expert parking again? 
looking behind him. I like that nice. detail. What a star. This has gone really quickly. Maybe it's just because I'm really nervous. So you can refuel there if you like, if you need to. Uh, yeah, let's let's refuel. Only 10 gil. Well, we haven't used much fuel. I just, this is just an adorable shot because he is the prince and he has three friends with him and they've made him do the refueling. Also, with that cap on, he looks like he's working there. Yeah. Thank you. Full tank. All right, let's go do one more battle on the beach. And then we'll come back up uh, and finish up the demo by entering the little town that is there, or the little, like, port that is there. What are we going to be fighting? Crabs again? Just the crabs, just to show a bit more, because we really did only have one battle last yeah. time, and we didn't show off the Ascension, the links, um, or really any magic last time. So I wanted to make sure I did it in today's demo. In fact, this is where we camped last time, and then we had the race with Gladio. I'm yep. not going to do it because we don't want to do that same race. I'll there probably are the lose. Crabs. Uh, let's see if I can craft any more magic. I may not have enough files on me. Let's look. If it's you want to see that the, the ice magic is stunning, it was used quite a lot in the Titan demo. Uh, we have a, quite a nice video of that on the channel. Uh, so if you want to see the ice magic used on its own, I really recommend checking it out because everything goes Made frosty. Made everyone go well frosty, didn't it? It's really cool. So have you just created a wild spell there? Yes, so unicast. Cast fire, blizzard, or thunder. Again, the more you put into it, the more powerful it becomes. Uh, I'm going to give it to Ignis because he hasn't actually uh, had any magic yet. And you can see, there it is, in wild. Because when I first saw this, I really wanted to know what wild magic was. Come on, not Get your breath Don't back, be lazy. Nonsense. I'm hoping Gladio stops me here before this battle, but we'll see. Wanna bash some heads in? Ah, uh, he's not gonna do it today. Ooh, head bashing! Try this! Oh, I missed that one. Ignis is taking care of that one for you, man. Nice. Right, Gladio, clean sweep for us. I love the combat in this, I really do. Everything about the combat just feels like an art form. Like the way the guys move. Look at, look at Prof on the floor, just being a badass. Alright, I only got A plus in offensive, but that looked good at least. Uh, which is really what I wanted to do. Uh, right, let's go. Uh, you got D for stealth again. Look, a plus anyone watch me stream offense. Dishonored? <laughs> You'd know that I definitely got a D Don't in do stealth. stealth. <laughs> okay. Let's head down to the little port here that is just on the right. Not fishing. Not fishing. No fishing. No today. fishing. No fishing. Man, his trainers would be getting full of sand now. I'd have taken them off, yeah. like, I'd have been furious, I would have been like complaining, I would have had to find like a shower to wash my feet. Uh, these guys, uh, you can buy weapons and stuff from, but I'm not going to do it today. Out of interest, Rent-a-Bird. rent bird Oh, the Chocobo's gone. Chocobo has gone. Just Hello, to show you um, some ideas. So you can see here, you can get the Beast, a custom decal set with a monster theme for people who are mad, bad, and born to be wild. 2,000 gil. Yep, you get racing stripes, and then here Ooh. you go. This is where you can buy soundtracks. Now, because again, this is a custom demo, there's quite a lot of the soundtracks already included. We hope to see you again. This looks very Killica. I said Besaid yesterday, but I'm changing my mind to Killica. You've changed your mind to Killica. Yeah, it looks I'd a lot like I'd rather you Killica. didn't, because Killica was just brutal, quite frankly. It was. Like, if you remember this Killica. Looks like, this looks a lot like it. I'm trying to, like, do the nice, like, view in the background, I realise he's just, like, he's like he's trying to run away from a sniper. 
I've just got him <laughs> shaking everywhere. But there you go. Welcome to Golden Key. I'm afraid you're King a this guy. I've seen him in loads oh, of trailers. Don't know who he is. The boats bring you here. What about him? Well, he is dressed to let you know he is not story? an NPC. <laughs> I'm not an NPC, <laughs> man. Ready to turn I've got a well-designed outfit and haircut. The ceasefire's getting us nowhere. What's this? Some sort of souvenir? They make those? No. Consider it your allowance. Huh? Yeah. Getting okay, bad so vibes from this guy. I, you haven't the seen King's Life, have you? Nope. That's obvious. Oh, yeah, right. Oh. All right. That was flawless. That exactly what I wanted to show you. I'm probably, I, I, I'm a huge Final Fantasy fan, and the fact that I get to be here on this stage showing off a new Final Fantasy game, 